Right, and so welcome back to another video on Premiere Pro. We're going to be showing you today how you can add subtitles to your YouTube Shorts, your long-form videos, or just your general content when you edit on Premiere Pro. So as you can see, I have a clip from a video that you guys probably should have watched, and if you haven't, go check it out. How to remove a green screen in Premiere Pro. We are going to add some subtitles to this to our so our viewer can easily understand what is going on. Right, and so, then so to do that, we are going to, to a Premiere first Pro. head up to our, I don't know what this panel exactly is called up here, but the panel that has a bunch of stuff in. We're then going to head over to the text one here, and it will then bring us up to this page. We want to head over to the transcribe. We don't want to go straight to captions yet. We want to go to the transcribe, and we're just going to just literally select transcribe sequence, and then you can choose no, don't separate your speakers. There's only one person talking in this video. We're going to let it transcribe. So transcribing is when it basically makes a script of your audio content. Premiere Pro is amazing at doing this with an AI, so we don't have to do it. We just have to check it. So what you would then do is once you have your once you have your transcribed text as you can see up here, it then highlights it as we sort of play the video. So if I play right, the video, so there, then welcome back as you can see it's highlighting each part pro as we go. Now I'm not gonna video. We're gonna go over hate this, and remove if you want to spell check it, you would double click on it and then just edit stuff to so say I just want it. this isn't how you type green screen, but you know, if say if I was to want to do that, I could do that. And that's just how you edit your transcript. So once you have a transcript you literally press the CC button. Now, if you went straight to making captions and then click the create captions from transcript, you already will have captions. But I personally recommend going to the transcript and then creating the captions as you get a few more options. So you want to create your captions. It will then bring up this little window here. So there's plenty of presets you can use or you can use your own and you can make, you know, however you want. I generally, for YouTube Shorts, when I'm filming YouTube Shorts, click the single. So once you're happy with those settings, it's then going to make the captions for you. And if we look on right, our timeline, so it comes into this to top bar, which is not any of our layers. Video. We're going to be doing over so how you can remove a green screen from a subject in Premiere Pro, and then put some sort of background behind behind another issue. Subject. But so yeah, we're going to start so playing. Getting, so we want to add a bit more effect to this. Don't do that. So these are all synced with your audio. So don't try and mess with them. We're going to highlight them, and we're going to select a background. When you generally see captions, you generally see them with a background. So I always just set that to black, and then I set this, and then I set this variable here to around 25. And as you can see, that gives us that kind of standard look. And also, we can use the align and transform and put it around the video. So say if I want to have it at the top like that, it would be at the top like that for our entire video. So that is how right, you add so track, welcome uh, back to so that is how you add captions in Premiere Pro in video. Really, really we're going to be doing over how really, really easy in Premiere Pro. That's why I really like using Premiere Pro. And then put so some yeah, sort of video, background behind. Check out the video subject. subject. Now, so I'm be sure so it will help you in the future. And I will see you in our next videos and find the video into our timeline.